Hello, my Leos. This is your daily for the 21st to the 22nd. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's pull an angel prayer for today. Cards are sticking together. Focus your mind. Thank you, angels, for helping me to focus on my priorities. Okay. What's most important to you at this point today, my Leos? Let's see what tarot messages we have from my Leo friends today. The Seven of Wands, being a little defensive, the Hanging Man, feeling stuck around something, hmm. And the Ten of Swords, huh, a lot of you just don't really know what to do during this time period. Um, part of you is saying just let it go, just take that stand, and um, you know, it's like you want to let this go. You want to move on past it. You want to put an end to this and go forward. But at the same time, it's like you're standing strong with just doing nothing. Like not addressing any issues, not addressing anything at all. I feel like some of you are willing to fight for something and some of you want to end it. Okay, and this may be going on in your head at the same time. Do I fight for this or do I just let it go? Let's see why this is happening. Devil, the Five of Pentacles, the Nine of, nine of Cups. Mm. Some of you want to fight for somebody that you feel very very a strong attachment to a strong attraction to um, you feel like you know this is the person that can either make you smile or make you crazy okay um, somebody that you feel like possibly put you out or you know rejected you like I mean physically put you out of a home or rejected you and um, you're trying to decide whether or not to to give in to this person, being with this person, even though they bring out the crazy in you, or, you know, let it go. Okay? Let it go. Be on your own. And just do you. It's like you really don't know what to do right now. Like you want to be happy, and I and I get that you know the nine of cups is like wish fulfillment. You you almost have you're you're almost at your ultimate fulfillment, but not quite, okay. And I think that you guys are seeking that tenth cup, and I feel like that tenth cup you feel um, lies with the other person, okay. Could be a Pisces individual that you are thinking of maybe Taurus Capricorn Gemini um, does not have to be those signs but um, some of you feel really kind of neglected left out put out even and this person makes you absolutely crazy but at the same time makes you happy okay so let's see what the outside what the influence is for you guys yeah we have a, a queen of swords here that can be very um, cutting with her tongue um, she also cuts through bullcrap but at the same time there's love here there's love here um, I also get the sense that somebody has something that they really want to say to you they really do um, hmm and I think you have something to say to them, too. You just haven't really decided. You know, you haven't made a solid decision to say, hey, I'm going to have a conversation with this person. Or, no, um, I'm going to let this go. This is over. I'm going to start over. I'm going to do me. You know, you haven't decided yet. So there is definitely a need to, you know, focus you know what is a priority for you what do you truly want here what is truly your wish fulfillment do you want that tenth cup or do you are you good at nine you know are you good by yourself or do you want to be with someone else here but there is somebody here that I feel has that that tenth cup for you 
All right. So let's see what the advice is for you guys. Mm. Mm -hmm. You know, for some of you, I'm going to say, you know, the advice is to fight for this. For others of you, the advice is to take into consideration the other person's point of view that maybe you both kind of played a part in whatever happened between the two of you. Um, the advice would be for some of you, do not fall into this double energy where you want to just, you know, just react um, and not respond because it's the need to respond, not just react. And in reacting, you can come off cutting, um, you can come off, you know, mean even. So that is the advice here, guys. Um, yeah. So that's what I have for you. And I will be speaking with you guys soon.